Hello, and welcome back to The Walking Dead. This time, episode 3, The Long Road Ahead. And it looks like we're going to have a train in this. Fantastic. Okay. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my camp. Oh, Dan, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. Made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon. I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. There's a train involved, so I assume we're going to be leaving, so... <laughs> That's a spoiler okay, there. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Kenny! You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Ugh. There's no safe way through that mess. Can I climb it? Still, I don't know if it's that. That's not safe. Nope. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Planks of wood. Move on. Maybe. Hmm. Huh. Looks like it still works. Okay. Wait. I don't have any. Okay. Lily's not doing so good, huh? It's not good. I'm worried. No shit. There's a lot to be worried about. She's gonna snap.
So now what? Oh, there's a winch control. Hmm. No. No, you don't look at it. Your girl's still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? I uh hope -huh. not. Hoping ain't worth a day. Do you have something bad to say about everything? Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit. I told you. Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get ah. off here. Don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. Okay, she's bitten, so. Fuck. You gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all too. Buying us time. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. I'm leaving her. She's already bitten. I feel so bad, but it's a risk to us, and that's really unfortunate. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Don't be a coward now! Don't be a coward now! Kenny? Kenny? Bridge! Bridge, okay. Again? 
Well, that works too. Oh my god, all those arrows. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. So, what did you get? Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? The Who winter is off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? <laughs> Can it, Carly? Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She got bitten. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look. Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! She really has a temper, doesn't she? Like her dad. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thank you. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. 
With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Uh, yeah, let's talk to Lily about the supplies. That seems more important right now. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? <laughs> I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you're using it when you shouldn't. Mm. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. A mystery. Oh God, Doc. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's wrong. <laughs> I know who it is. I didn't realize Batman was a detective. Wow. You can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. <laughs> okay, well, Duck will help. Humor this child. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. <laughs> what about? You're a convicted killer. Car Thanks! Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People <laughs> might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? Yeah. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Put everything on the table. Everybody. Whoa. <laughs> you'll thank me later. Whoa. <laughs> now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. 
Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. <laughs> and the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. <laughs>